Boris Brat is described as an icon in the Canadian music industry. The 78-year-old conductor was killed this morning in a hit and run in downtown Hamilton. It began early this morning, just after 10, when witnesses say a car was driving the wrong way on Markland Street. And as it turned on Park Avenue, the car struck Brat. He later died in hospital. Police say the driver fled the scene in his car, but was arrested on Elmwood Avenue near Garth Street on the mountain. That's about a five-minute drive from the first crash. The driver and three police officers were taken to hospital. We have one male in custody, a 33-year-old male. In the area where the arrest took place, a police cruiser is damaged sitting on a front lawn. Another appears to have boxed in the car with a smashed windshield. The brand new fence of a home on Elmwood Street completely ripped off, trees torn down. Because police were involved, the Special Investigations Unit has now taken over the case. Reaction has, of course, been pouring in. The Boris Brown social media accounts say it is with the heaviest of hearts that we announce the sudden and tragic passing of the one and only musical genius and Canadian artistic visionary Boris Brock. NDP leader Andrea Horvath says she's heartbroken over this loss, writing, From the National Academy Orchestra of Canada to Brock Music Festival and beyond, he shared his love of music with Hamont and the world. Liberal MP for Hamilton West Ancaster Dundas Philomena Tassi writes, A terrible tragedy and loss for our city and for Canada. Former president of the Hamilton Chamber of Commerce, Keenan Loomis, weighed in, writing, More carnage on our street, this time taking the life of an icon who created decades of culture and brought so much acclaim to our city.